Hey there, Dad, how are you? Welcome to this page. So, being a dad, before we start, I want you to close your eyes. I want you to think back to the day that your son or daughter was born. You're now a role model. You've now said to yourself, I'm gonna do all these things to be here, to see them grow, to set an example and commit. And we committed. And if you're like me, I did exactly the same thing too. All right, that was 17 years ago with my firstborn. So again, she's 17 going on 18, about to go into university. My son, he's 13 going on 14. And I made those commitments and I made those promises. But in my 40s, I lost sight. I lost sight of me. I struggled with the weight. I ballooned up and down. It wasn't 10 to 15 kilos. I ballooned to 115. I was 25 kilos heavier than what I should have been. And I made excuses. I made up stories about why I just couldn't be. And you know what? Now we're here. We talk about the dad bod. Yeah, I'm just a dad bod. Well, that's BS. And perhaps I was depressed. But really, it comes down to one thing. I didn't have a system in place. And that system may well have saved me from what happened to me at 42, and that was two strokes. Two transient isochemic attacks, they're a mini stroke, but I had them six months apart. They scared the crap out of me. And I was bossing it at work, career was going well, but as I would come home, as the kids were getting older, they're still kids. You know, four and five or so at the time, there was a disconnect. I didn't have the energy. I didn't want to be around them. They were just sucking the life out of me. I would fall asleep on the couch. I would snore like a freight train. Early signs of sleep apnea, the Darth Vader mask. And consequently, I didn't have a relationship with my partner. We were just like, you know, why bother? We'd look at each other and go, hmm. So it took me to go into a deep dark hole and have that little medical emergency for me to wake up. And I'm here to tell you, I don't want you to do that. I need you to become a dad. I want you to become a role model. And I want you to drop that 10 or 15 kilos that you've got that you think is weighing you down. And I want to fix that disconnect between the work life and the home life. You see, as a dad and as a role model, you can have it all, but you've got to put in the damn work. And it's not the one and a half to two hours a day, three or four days a week in the gym, busting your ass. You're a dad, and as a dad, that ain't an off switch. Being a dad, being a parent, it's every damn day. So our program is built around that, but it's little pieces every damn day. Little tiny bits that when they add up, we drop the 10 or 15, we get the energy back, we sleep well, we wake rested, we don't navel gaze at food labels and stuff because we know that when we're eating the right stuff and eating the right things, it's fuel, it's energy for us to burn. And yet, and mentally, we're pushing off depression. We no longer have anxiety. We've got better tools than turning to booze and alcohol and drugs because we're doing the work every day. If that's you and you think I can help you, then all I need you to do is click on the link below. I need your name, your email, your phone, Tell me more where you are. Go to page two and let's see if we can help you. That's it. Being a dad, being a role model, being you leading the way. Let's go.